Welcome to the library of the Jerusalem Academy for Music and Dance. The following is a guide for students of the cross-disciplinary department concerning procedures for use of the library, reading room, audio and video listening room, the library computer program, and databases for home use. The library is open from Sunday through Wednesday from 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. and on Thursday from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Once you confirm having watched this instructional guide, we will issue a reader's card for you, which will enable you to borrow up to 12 items, books or scores, simultaneously, in accordance with the loan status of the items. Items without a colored sticker are loaned out for four weeks. Items with a blue sticker for one week, with a yellow sticker overnight, and those with a red sticker are not loaned out. Most of the library has barcodes, and this is the way the stickers look on them. On items that are marked by hand, the stickers look like this. Items on loan for one week or for four weeks are automatically renewed if they are not on order. An item on order cannot be renewed. If you need an item which is on loan, order it so that the automatic renewal will be blocked. If an item on loan to you has been ordered, you will receive an email to that effect. We collect through the bursar's office fines of four shekels a day for items on order or items on loan overnight that have not been returned on time, plus one shekel per day for every day late after your eligibility to use the library expires at the end of your studies. Avoid late returns. Items that don't leave the library can be photocopied or scanned. Use of our scanner is free of charge and next to it is a set of instructions for use. There are two photocopying machines inside the library and two just outside the door. Removing an item from the library to photocopy it requires actually loaning it at the desk. It's possible to return borrowed books even after library hours by using the returns box outside the library. When the library is open, please do not return items to the box, but to the desk in the library. Use of photocopying machines is with a card that you can get from the librarians and return for a deposit of 10 shekel. The deposit will be returned to you when you give back the card. The card has to have money added to it, and the rates for copying are 20 agorot for A4 size page, 40 agorot for an A3 or B4 page. When you are finished photocopying, press the red button and wait for the notice, Hotsek Altis, remove card before retrieving it. In case of any problem, call the librarian and do not open the photocopying machines on your own. Eating and drinking are forbidden in the library. Keep the noise level down. Cell phones must be turned off or turned to vibrate. No phone conversations, please. Kind, kindly check the computer for what you need and rather than removing an entire shelf of material, but anything that you have taken out and used, please leave on the tables and do not return to the shelves on your own. The reading room. The reading room is divided into books and scores. Behind the loans desk and on the reference shelves in the library entrance are materials that are especially widely used. Beethoven piano sonatas, the well-tempered clavichord, Bach chorales, harmony, counterpoint, and orchestration books, and in jazz, some copies of the first and second volumes of the real book in C, E flat, and B flat, the first volume of the fake book, the vocal real book, the new real book, and the omnibooks of Charlie Parker, Miles Davis, and John Coltrane. On the reference shelves near the entrance are music history books and encyclopedias, Grove's Dictionary of Music and Musicians in 29 volumes, which is also avail available to you in the online version, an encyclopedia of world music in 10 volumes and more. Near the entrance is also a bookcase with instructors' materials for their courses. Most of the reading room is arranged, as are most of the libraries in Israel, according to the system of the Library of Congress in the USA. Each item in the library has a shelf number consisting of two parts. Before the dot is a code whose ending, as far as you are concerned, is almost arbitrary, for example, in the scores before us, MP1, popular music by one artist or group. After the dot are letters and numbers in alphabetical order, generally of composers or authors. 
The numbers after the letters that are after the dot and only after the dot are numbers in the tens column. For example, D47 equals D4.7. Thus, D47 is found before rather than after D5, and in actuality, Neil Diamond at D47 comes alphabetically before dire straits. The items are set up in columns so that before the first item on the top shelf of the column is the last item on the bottom shelf before it. The library is built like a snake, alternatively from the wall to the window and from the window to the wall. The library's collection is divided into the books collection and the music or scores collection. After the first wall, the dance collection, the books are divided into ML, music literature, and MT, music theory. On the outside panel of each bookcase is marked the main contents to be found in it, but the exact book number must be found in the online catalog. The ML collection includes books on music history, biographies, etc. The ML books on jazz and popular music have moved to the back of the library temporarily. MLJ1, general books on jazz, MLJ2, books on certain jazz musicians, organized according to name, MLP1, books on various types of popular music. The MT collection begins with general and musical education, guided listening, and elementary theory. Next are books concerning all fields of theory, and after them, analysis books organized according to composer and other criteria. The last part of MT contains workbooks for beginners arranged by instruments in the following order. Keyboard instruments, mainly piano, strings from high to low, woodwinds and brass according to their order in orchestral scores, plucked instruments, and percussion. In general, each instrument is given two shelf names, first for basic instruction and then for easy pieces. Since piano has so much material, the breakdown is more detailed. This instrumental order will recur several times in the library, including in the internal organization of jazz scores. Books on the theory of jazz and on light music are in the MT section in a sub-area of their own. The score collection consists mainly of classical music store, scores, collections first of instrumental music from one instrument, then of ensemble music from small to large, and finally of vocal music. In the vocal music section after the operas is an area of musicals, generally in piano vocals format. If you borrow music with a part for the accompanist or for chamber music co-players, you must take and of course return all the parts together as they are cataloged as one item. If a part is missing, it is noted both on the music and on the computer. However, if a part is missing, please call our attention to this when you are borrowing the item. In the continuation of the vocal section, there are also, among other things, popular songs according to country. Miniature or pocket scores. Most of the full scores in the library are in small format with the shelf number MM. They are generally organized according to the order we've seen in the large format. Chamber music, orchestral, concerti, operas, vocal, and sacred music. Israeli music is in a separate section. We refer here mostly to Israeli concert music, and this is organized more or less in parallel to the order of the international music in the library. At the end of the Israeli music section are also songbooks with notes. The first and sometimes only copy of Israeli music and books in Hebrew is located in what we call the archive, located in the head librarian's office or in locked closets. As we shall see further on, the search default in the catalog does not include the archive. However, it's possible to select a search that includes the archive as well. Access to the archive is only through library staff. Also at the back of the library are particularly large scores, MO, oversize, generally contemporary music. Here too is the area of Arabic books and music, AR, Russian books, RUS, and the most important shelf for the cross-disciplinary department, the section of jazz and popular music notes. Jazz notes, shelf number MJ, start with the minus one series, each volume of which has noted on it the number of the corresponding CD. Continuing are more copies of the real book collections, most volumes of which appear in four versions, C, E flat, B flat, and bass clef, 
as well as the competing series Facebook and a separate series New Real Book. After that come scores organized according to instrument. Worthwhile noting is the series Artist Transcriptions that contains solos professionally transcribed by ear. The popular music collection MP is under construction since the time the cross-disciplinary program left the Ramon School and its library. MP0 Collections. MP1, music of one composer or group, alphabetically, according to family names of composers or names of groups. At the back of the library are periodicals in print, organized alphabetically, and separately, Hebrew periodicals according to the Hebrew alphabet. Today, most of the periodicals are online only. Periodicals include magazines like Downbeat and academic periodicals such as Popular Music. On the back window sill are books that don't pertain to music or dance, art, folklore, literature, statistics, and others. Psychology and cognition books are annexed to the dance shelf at the beginning of the library. Past the listening room is a room with a large collection of the late conductor Gary Bertini. This connection is not full loan. Currently, the listening and viewing room is mainly in use as an extension of the computer room during the hours it's closed to students. Most of the viewing and listening today is online, not only on YouTube, but also through the databases to which the Academy subscribes. The library listening collection includes classical music, jazz, Arabic music, other ethnic music, and a small amount of popular music, mainly Israeli. One collection that mostly does not exist online is Israeli concert music. The viewing collection is mostly opera, dance, and jazz performances, and the History of Jazz series. The collection is in closed closets and is accessible only through library staff, according to the number found in the computerized catalog. The listening room collection is not for loan. Items can be brought to classes or lessons upon receipt of an ID card. You have legal approval to burn or copy all the materials in the library for learning purposes. You must bring us an original signed form of commitment to fair use. For audio files, you rip in Windows Media Player. DVD files can be dragged to a file. However, nearly all commercial DVDs are protected and are impossible to copy. Searching the library catalog. The library catalog is online and easily accessible from the Academy site through the Library tab and the Secondary Library tab, Search the Catalog. Most searches are possible with the same ease as with an ordinary search engine, but since this catalog has passed through human hands, its entries are indexed, making browsing through alphabetical listings possible. The catalog generally contains only names of books, of music, but for the main real books and some of the books of Hebrew songs, we have included detailed contents. Articles from periodicals are not in our catalog, but can be searched in the databases. In the search program, at the top of the toolbar in the center, there's the possibility of changing language by clicking on Change Language. That way you can get to English. The default is words from all fields in the main library. Alternatives to main library are all the library, which includes the archive, and limiting in advance according to type of material, musical notes, books, etc. Using words from all fields allows searching as in a search engine. To find an expression of several words, click on adjacent words, yes. One possibility that exists in this system and not in Google's is so-called amputation. Adding a question mark at the end of a name or word, or in fact anywhere in the word, and then all the results containing that part of the word appear. For example, if I am unsure of the spelling of the name Ellington, I can type E-L question mark ing ton. By writing the question mark instead of the second L, the name will come up whether or not there is a second L. Of course, in this case, results will come up with other words such as Elkington if they exist. The search must be in Latin letters. The only items cataloged in Hebrew are Hebrew books, Israeli music scores, and recordings of vocal music. The list of received results can be sorted according to any field that is underlined, author, title, publisher, year, or shelf number. In the LIB slash items field, 
we can see the general number of copies in the library slash the number of copies that are on loan. If we see, for example, one slash one, it means that the only copy is on loan and there is no point in checking the shelf. Clicking on the result in this field will let you know the loan status of each copy. Here, you can also place an order for a copy that is on loan. You must enter your username and password, actually your ID number twice. You can check your own list of loan items as well as the status of your orders through your reader's card, which you go into in the upper right hand corner. To see full details of the items, such as performers on recordings, click on the number on the left side. The alternatives to words from all fields are words from a particular fields or browsing a particular field, authors, titles, performers, or subjects. Subjects in our catalog are always in English, even for Hebrew books. For example, the subject Harmony will also pull up Harmony books in Hebrew. A composer can appear as a subject if this is material about him. Subject and musical notes will always be a combination of genre, an ensemble or instrument, such as sonatas, violin. In jazz, the subjects always begin with the word jazz and then according to instrument. Please note that searching in words from subject pulls up 1603 results while searching through browsing the selected subject jazz piano, but in words from all fields, we get 4,728 results. These include many listings, mainly recordings, with a different solo instrument and piano as part of the backup group. All of popular music is under the subject popular music without subdivision into genres. In a search yielding five results or less, for example, jazz accordion in words from subject, the full record comes up automatically for the first result. It's possible to browse among the results or go to the results list. Go into copies to see if the loan, if the item is loaned out. The program also allows advanced search, mainly cross-referencing fields. A useful possibility is cross-referencing language, the first three letters, for example, H-E-B for Hebrew, with another field. Thus, a search for forms in Hebrew yields seven items in the main library only. Finally, items that are not in our library can be ordered from another library through an interlibrary loan by Yossi, the head librarian. Go into the Other Libraries tab and choose Union List Israel. There you can find which library holds the item. Send the details to Yossi by email at yosefg, Y-O-S-E-F-G, at J-A-M-D dot A-C dot I-L. Databases for home use. The library just subscribes to many materials for home use. Audio and video recordings, scores and research materials. Access is through the Academy site, on the Library tab, Secondary tab, Access to Databases. The page includes a link to the site of Athens, the commercial company where our da databases are. After opening a reader's card, we will open for you a database account. Access to each of the databases is supposed to be free of charge, and if you are asked to pay, see Yossi in order to repair the situation. Besides this, there are databases which give us only partial access to their contents. In order to access the databases, you must identify yourself through Athens. If the page is empty when you open it, move from the Home tab to Resources Databases. The databases are commercial and are not a digitization of our library connect collections. Listening Database Naxos Music Library for Classical Music and Naxos Music Library Jazz. Both of these contain many performances that are not available on the free web. The jazz database is not consistent in its level and much depends on the companies which, with which the artists recorded. The complete collections of EMI, DECA, Deutsche Grammophon, and others are in this database. Another advantage of Naxos over YouTube is that the material is organized captioning is complete and reliable, advanced search is possible, and there is access to booklets that accompany the CDs. For example, if we search Sonny Rollins, we find his albums, and within each album it's possible to go into a particular piece. On Naxos, you can listen but not download. You can create a listening list of your own once you have signed up, which is free. 
You can connect to the database through any device that connects to the internet, but cannot connect to the Naxos app because identification through Athens is necessary for that. Viewing database, classical performance in video. The database includes operas, dance, and concert performances. In large works, it's possible to go straight to a particular piece or selection, as well as to watch the entire work. The viewing files are large and need relatively high-speed internet. Notes or scores database. Classical scores are available, as you know, on the free site imslp.org. Only works and editions that are not still under copyright laws appear there. We subscribe to an additional database called Classical Scores Online. It's possible to download material from this database to the computer. The database is not consistent in its quality. For example, Stravinsky is very well presented there while Shostakovich barely appears. Reference materials. Grove, the online edition of the encyclopedia that exists in print as well. Oxford Scholarship Online, online books. There is access only to a few books and they are cataloged in the library catalog with a direct link. Periodicals. Unfortunately, they arrive separately from each supplier and we have no way to know which articles are in each of them. Dance has two main databases. JSTOR, which generally includes periodicals from their beginnings until not too long ago, without those of the very last years. Basic search uses the full text, but there are other possibilities too. It is not simple to search periodicals that arrive separately, but if there is a referral, you can browse and locate them. Usually a search in the freescholar.google.com finds where to search, but has no access. Then you have to reach the periodical through browsing. Hebrew periodicals, index to Hebrew periodicals. Whatever has full text online is linked to a name, but for most of the items there is only information and then they must be located in the library or elsewhere. Realm, as above, bibliographical references alone, but in the most complete manner. Access is through the first resource and choosing Realm. This is an advanced resource for those who want to locate all that's been written on a particular subject. Generally, many of the results are in German and other languages, and limiting according to language is recommended. For further questions, we are at your service.